Hello, Mahin Kasol here for The Gamer to show you the best way to farm money in Pokemon BDSP. Poke dollars are seemingly easy to come by in Pokemon BDSP, but as you'll soon see, it's just as easy to use it all on potions, revives in battle, or maybe you need more Pokeballs and repels for shiny hunting. By the way, check out the link in the description for that video. Anyway, whatever the use, you're going to need a quick and easy way to make some of that sweet old PD. That doesn't involve taking on the Elite Four over and over again, and we've got just that. Before we get to that however, we're going to need a few items first. First of all, we're going to need that amulet coin. This is an item when held by a Pokemon, doubles the prize money, and can be found in Amity Square right over there. You're also going to need your Versus Seeker, but this is given to you early on in the game's story, so don't worry. Now go to Route 212 and go past these policemen until you bump into this old couple. If it isn't obvious yet, they're stinking rich and will always have a few spare poker dollars to donate to us, the poor. Just keep using the Versus Seeker until they want to battle and keep rebattling them for 8,160 poker dollars per battle. But to really squeeze the most out of this old couple's pension, be sure to have one of your battling Pokemon hold that amulet coin for a whopping 16,320 poker dollars every battle. With this method, it's easy to run around all of Sinnoh and just re-challenge anyone you feel is just looking a little bit too wealthy. And another double battling duo to challenge actually makes us more money than the elderly couple. This duo is a pair of ace trainers and can be found on Route 210, and with the amulet coin, will award you 26,784 poker dollars every time. This battle is always guaranteed to be a double battle also, so if you want to repeat this method as fast as you can, Get yourself a Pokemon with a move that hits two Pokemon at once and then turn the battle animations off in the settings. This will really speed things up and you'll be a Pokemon billionaire in no time. If you want to take this a step just a little bit further, you can also have a Pokemon on your team with the ability pick up so you can possibly sell items found by Pokemon during battle. Uh, this along with the other few methods aren't always the most time effective but still a fun method of making money, who am I to judge? Do what you want, make your money however you want. But my recommendation is just, you know, to stick to the ace trainers as they're quick and easy. And that's how to steal money from your rich grandparent. I mean, how to farm money in Pokemon BDSP. A happy Christmas to you all. I've been Mahin Kasol for The Gamer and a happy new year.